All right, ignore the background. <laughs> if I don't beat prisons in 24 hours, I'll have to delete all of my coins. And to do that, I'm gonna need some overpowered armor, a new custom enchant, and a ton more stuff. But I'm ready. Hey, this video took way too long. It's surprisingly hard to become this powerful. Subscribe, or I will explode your house with just my... With just... With just my... Or you'll find a spider in your shoe tomorrow. Also, when the video comes out, the server just reset and you can get a head start right now. So go play it. It's in the description. And it's my server. Please, I want to see you. Gameplay. Okay, first things first, there's something I need to sort out because this has been bugging me for a while. I have $155 billion and my pick is okay. You know, it does this. So I'm making good money now. My pick is officially better than any of the robots ever. And that's sort of the thing I've got to work on real quick. This can be so much better because these enchants are just the first two tiers of enchants out of four. We haven't even gotten to the really good ones yet. Dragon's Breath being the main one. Bombs Away, Neutron Star. It's like going to an enchant table, but one of the enchants costs a thousand levels and it flings meteors at your world. It's a pretty cool upgrade and I need it. The problem with that is, I'm level 11 now, but I need to be level 15 to unlock the next tier and like 20 or 25 to get to the tier beyond that. But luckily, whenever jackhammer or explosive go off, I get a bit of a bump. Oh my god! Okay, a large bump. What the f- Okay, I go up like a half bump every time. To get the items I'm gonna need in order to prestige, get to the top rank and beat prisons, I'm gonna need some crazy stuff. A lot of custom gear I cannot get by being poor. So I need to become rich. I'm not gonna be able to do that on this tiny little pickaxe level, so I gotta mine for a while. You know, that wasn't actually too hard. This is pretty good. I got two shark keys, which is kind of lucky. But the pickaxe is level 15 now. That did not take long at all. In fact, it took 23 minutes and 40 seconds. I'm making the seconds up, but it took 23 minutes. <laughs> my pickaxe is now prestige three, which means my enchant power is plus 15. And it means I have unlocked tier three enchants. How much is maxing out dragon's breath? I have 172 billion. There's no way I can't. Yep, yeah, easy. And you know what? Screw it. While I'm... Oh, actually, no. I want to see dragon's breath go off a little bit. I sort of really want to know how much it makes. Oh, hello! There it is, dragons. Let me reset the mine. They're all just inside there right now. What the? Oh my god, it's lacking. There's so many of them. 8.7 million. 8.7 million blocks that netted me 180 million dollars. That's sick, dude. 0.25% chance of happening. So it's one of the rarer ones, but it does give a lot of money. What enchant next? Neutron star. I should get next. The guy that has prestige four, uh, the higher rank, he said get neutron star. I'm getting neutron star. How much is 10k of this? Oh, whoops. Well, okay. How much is 9k of this? Seven bill. That's the cheapest thing on earth. Is it maxed out at 5k? Oh, it is. Okay, well, that's cheap. What's 10k of this? 11 bill. You know what? That's cheap too. Why not? I'll get bombs away. I've heard that's good. The one that people said get more explosive and jackhammer, but it costs so much money. 4,900 levels of this would cost $169 billion, man. And I've got better things to spend money on. I know you saw something in the intro. Where are they, by the way? There you are. If I go into my auto miners, I already put fortune on all of them, but now I'm on level 15. They're on level 14. These things need to level up faster, and the only way I can think of doing it is giving these guys enchant. So these guys are sort of the backbone of the server. If I just do nothing for a while, the fact that I've got five of these means I make 172,000 e-tokens every four seconds I make that. AFK! To upgrade them, this guy says do fortune first, explosive and jackhammer to 5k. They level up faster and all unlock all the other enchants. That was exactly my plan. Mainly because those are the only enchants I have available to me. How much to put 5,000 on it? 11 bills! I've got that! In theory, he should now start leveling up a lot. But here's the problem I always have with it. This is just the first one. If you go all the way to the fifth one, let's do the same thing. Let's put 5,000 on explosive. Costs 11 billion before, and on this one it costs 56. Hey, yo, what the fuck? But everyone always says these guys are absolutely wild with money making in the background. And the other thing about it is getting these guys leveled up faster is great if you're prestiging, which I'm gonna do today because all my coins are on the line for it. And if you don't know, I have 12,000 coins right now, which is worth like 130 bucks, but I gotta prepare for that. When you prestige, everything gets reset, except for some stuff. And there's a big reason why you do this. It increases your cell multiplier, which means you get more money faster. It increases all of your robot speeds. Oh, and did I mention, you keep the robots, you keep the drills, you keep the quarry, you keep the auto mine. It's the meta, it's the game 
game winning strategy and I have not done any of it. I'm really supposed to upgrade, up, upgrade, upgrade the quarry, but it is half done. Seven billion. That's two billion. Okay, I'll get jackhammer. Two billion. There we go. Explosive. Another two billion. I'll do that. I'll do this because why not? I want to wait and see how much faster this guy starts leveling up compared to the others. Is this now a fully maxed out pick? 50 out of 50. 10k, 10k. 10k, 10k. These are unlimited, so it doesn't count. In all fairness, a really good way of making more money right now will probably be to rank up, but every other block's kind of ugly, not gonna lie. Do I want to do that to myself? I gotta level up eventually, though. I've still got this good axe. It isn't very fast at just making beacons is the problem. And I'm in a bit of an advantage here where it's the morning where, like, barely anyone is on. Like, look, there's one guy in PvE right now. How am I using an auto clicker? You can hear me clicking. <laughs> I have no idea why I got told this last episode. This does not feel like an easier way to make beacons. This sucks. Okay, well, I've just got to do this. I mean, I, th these mobs are not going to generate me a lot, but I've got to. I think out of all those mobs I just killed, I went up like maybe 200 beacons. However, I do have one pretty cool update. Look at this guy. The rest of them, 15 levels. This guy, 17. I knew that it'd make a difference. All of them are level 15, which means I should have unlocked these enchants, which is pretty cool. If I go up to laser 5,000, how much does that cost? Just so I can really make one crack. Crazy. 8 billion? Yeah, why not? I still really want a sword, though. The one I want is called Berserker. How much does 100 levels cost? 1 million beacons. That is sort of good, though. It means the barrier to entry for this sort of stuff is high. And I saw a sword with maxed out Berserker on AH yesterday for 475,000. Which sort of makes me feel like I can get it cheaper, like I'm being scammed or something. Hey, fellas, I'm looking to buy a max Berserker sword. I can do 1.75. That's actually a good price. My goal is to kill bosses. Killing mobs is fine, but you're competing with other players. You gotta find them in the first place. This is just too slow. I've got 300 beacons. This is awful. Instead of spending all my time doing this, what I could be doing is going after boss fights. No matter how much damage you do, you at least get some boss credit. And boss credits allow you to buy stuff on the boss shop. It's like a whole different currency. All I want is the boss crate. It's a thousand credits. I got 600 already. It's not too hard to make these credits. Well, technically, if you spend a full hour absolutely going hard, fine with the something like this, like this axe, you could make more. But why would you do that when you can mine on your mind, make money, level everything up, and then just as soon as there's a boss fight that's activated, go kill the boss. Those boss crates, dude, I have sold them for so much money on Auction House because they're valuable. And they're worth a lot. Even opening them is a great way to get stuff like robots that will farm automatically for you. But it's a bit of a risk. You can just lose. Same as a normal crate key. So, I've guarded a trade with one of the mods who has a spare sword for one thousand. 1,600 coins to trade for one of these cool swords. Sharpness 25, soul steel, absolutely maxed out boss killing sword. And this will become my weapon so I can make thousands of beacons. Well, I'll go get some mining done and I'll see you when it's at 500. There's 120 mobs left to kill, but I want to do something. Look at this armor. It's leather. The skins on the server give special abilities. The pickaxe, you know what the pickaxes do. Kablamo. The skins, on the other hand, usually just give a cell booster. I have a pretty cheap set right now. It gives me a 50% cell booster, which means instead of being at like 4.1, I'm at 4.65. Not bad. But obviously, there are so much better. And now I have a ton of money. Look at what I am able to get. There's something like this that gives an extra 0.3. The ones after it is what are what were uh, is what is what you wish. You could, you do. A what is worth a ton. The one that I want is the next one up. Besides giving you a little bit of extra cell buff, this thing lets you jump into the air like a frog. You can trigger an inferno, kill all the mobs in the area. On the chest plate, it gives you the ability to 2x your damage. And on the helmet, if you're low on health, all mobs will be just pushed away by a force field. It is an overpowered piece of armor. So before the next boss gets triggered, I am going to get my hands on it. I've worked out a trade with one of the top players. I know that the armor's worth about 2k or less per piece, which works out to 8,000 for the whole set of armor. I was initially going to buy just each piece from someone else and negotiate separately, but someone wanted to offload their thing because I think they wanted the next skin up or they wanted to trade it, which is like this one. They're getting rid of their El Eldarian? Eldarian? El Eldarian armor? El you, you want? They're getting rid of the purple armor. <laughs> And I managed to get this for kind of a steal, not gonna lie. 7 to 8k is around the going rate. I negotiated down to 6.5 because they said 7 at first. This is PvE focused, and that's exactly what I want in order to absolutely destroy the bosses and the mobs in PvE. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, look how cool that looks, holy shit. I look like someone out of Skyrim, dude. This looks sick. Look at the 
Fucking arm him. Yeesh. Let me test this out. How do you do it? Is it shift? shift jump. Oh my god! That's wild. How often can I do this? Oh, I can just keep doing it. So if I need to, if I need to get into an area, I can just jump. And I just decide like, ah, I don't want to be here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, wait, did you see that? Oh my god, I just got saved. I was on one heart and they were trying to run at me, but a force field was pushing them back. So I can just, what, never die to melee attacks now? So I'm under four hearts right now. Yeah, look, it just force fields them away. Hey, guys. <laughs> hey, guys. Hey, you want to try and hit me? Try and hit me. Hey, come at me. Come on. Dude, this is awesome. Imagine how good this would be for dungeons. Oh, I'm under four hearts. Look at that. Oh, okay, so skeletons can still kill me. I gotta fix my armor up real quick. I just saw the beacon timer at 480. Back on, warp PV, let's go. I just need to get into that big hangar. I've been told a good tip for killing boss mobs, by the way. To get more damage, which gets us more points, is to use this new sword that I've got. What I'm looking for is that berserker ability to proc. Hello! Oh my god, no, it's the explosive one. Okay, that's not the best. Either way, what a proc looks like is a bunch of swords flashing in the air. You know what? Nope, not gonna deal with that right now. And as soon as I see those swords go off, I'm gonna start using my axe. I'm leaving around. I'm not. I'm not. Oh my. Yeah, that's smart that I jumped out of that the last time. There it is. Okay, it just went off, I think. Oh, Jesus. I got a feeling something bad's gonna happen. Bye. Oh, that does. Nope. Ah! Oh my god. That guy died too, but he has to rely on jumping. I have speed three. Oh god, he's targeting me. That's not good. Nope. I'm leaving. <laughs> Let me just see if I can gap. And boop. Goodbye. TNT go off. And again, TNT go off. There we go. Oh, dude, I was like fourth place out of three. Oh, but I got so many boss credits. Holy 3,791, which means I can buy one, two, three. They're worth their weight in gold. I'm going to open at least one of them because the rewards from it are nuts. I'm breaking six armor would be pretty dope right now. All these different robots, a skin key or a trident key would be profit. Now, I'm going to guess a lot of people put these on AH. Yeah, immediately. So 8,000 beacons for one of them. I'm going to open one of them now. Three, two, one. Oh, skin key. That is not bad. Oh my God. Wait, that's profit then. Item what worth? 150 coins? Dude, I can get coins out of this. You know, it's worth a lot, but when people say that it's worth coins instead of beacons. Okay, I'm going to open another one just because why not? Boom. Wow, that was trash. And then I'll do, screw it. I'll do the last one. I just made such big profit on just that. Boom. Oh, <laughs> Let's go! Selling two skin keys, 300 GC. Let's go, dude! 300 coins from fighting what? Ah, do you mind? I just killed your big brother. Do you mind? I was a little off on my math, so I lowered it. It's about 280, not 300, so I've lowered it again to 269, just because I think someone will buy it, just because it's funny. Oh, this guy. Okay, so this guy's top rank. He's got the 30,000 coin pick. Oh my god. Oh, he's got the same armor as me, too. Let's go. There you go. Skin key, skin key, 269 coins. There you go. I just made $3. Made $3 in real life. I spent five minutes. I made three dollars. Did I just make minimum wage from playing Minecraft? No, it's more than that. I made th I make <laughs> made $36 an hour. The equivalent of $36 an hour playing Minecraft. Not bad. Not bad at all. I could have traded all that for a about, okay, maybe 200,000 beacons might be a lot, but about 150,000 beacons as well. Oh my god, look at my multiplier. I'm now at 5.18. I used to be at 4.6. I am making more money out of this. That's probably the main function of buying the armor, but I also like being able to do that. <laughs> Pickaxe level 17, very nice. Let me check on my auto miners. 22 already? Oh my god, hold on, okay. Let me upgrade the rest of these dudes. Oh no, I don't know if I should spend my money. Hmm. I'm gonna make my goal to just rank up right now. Oh, this mine looks better. Oh, Oh, this looks classy, dude. Oh, look at that. It's classy. Something in a nice hotel room. Rank up again. Oh, now it's beans. Rank up again. Yeah, it's back to classy. Let's get to 1,100 at least. Oh, is the mine changing? My mine size is now over 100 by 100 blocks. Means this thing can do a little more damage, I think. Ooh. Yeah, no kidding. Made 12 million out of that. And then I should be able to make more out of my pickaxe skin ability. Yep. And I have only gone, I've only gone down a little bit. So let's keep going. Rank up next. Rank up again. Still a little classy. I don't know if it's going to continue to be. Ah! It's still a little classy. I don't like it. Okay, how much further can I go? Because each one of these is now costing about 4 billion a pop. 1,200. Oh, everyone's saying GG to me that I got to 1,250. Let's go. Everyone's so nice here. What the hell? Oh my god, it bombs away. All right, dude, wait. Okay, this enchant I got ages ago, and I, this is the first time it's ever activated. I'm making $1.3 billion every minute. Bombs away just made me 13 million blocks. Holy. Okay, that's good. Oh, what PVE. The boss just spawned. It's another exploding creeper. God, okay. That sort of sucks, but I can at least outpace all these people in order to get to it. Okay, how many people are here? Ah, uh, not as many. All I can hear is the amount of people clicking. Oh, the, okay, wait. This might not last very long, and then let me boost out of this, because I don't have the protection for it. I just want to see Berserk. 
that could go off. There it is. There it is. There it is. It went off. I just saw it go off. Now I just swapped to using my axe just for a little bit until that's sort of regenerated. And let me back up and gapple and then back into the fight. Third place. Let's go. Okay. I didn't get as many credits that time. That looked more random. Like I actually got a little, I actually got less. I got enough to buy two though because I got less damage in. Now I don't think rare ones are going to be worth an awful lot. Well, screw it. Let's open them. Why not? I've honestly never been lucky with this. The best thing you can get is like maybe some keys. A phantom pick could be okay, but even they don't sell for a ton. All right, let's screw it. Let's do it. Boop. E-token pouch. Boop. Crystals. Boop. E-token pouch. thing I do care about is two of the legendary ones. Boom, boom. All right, let's do some gambling. Ready? Three, two, one. What? <laughs> Dude, how do I keep getting skin keys? This is actually really lucky for me. I'm gonna do another 360. It's working. All right, and what? Oh, what the fuck? I found a cheat code. I found a cheat code. I literally made another three dollars, dude. I literally, I make, I make thirty dollars an hour. What the? Fuck? I need blast protection five on my armor. I can do one. I can put it on my leggings. Bam. I only need twenty kgc. Maybe I should only sell this for coins. Oh, I really like the fire thing. The fire thing's really cool. I've got another four k. That means I can put it on one more piece of armor. Let's grab it on my chest plate. Five blast damage. Let's go. <sighs> okay, I'd really like to mine, but you know the next boss. Is He's in 60 beacons, so let's level up a couple more times. Rank up next. Oh, it's gross now. Let's do it again. Oh, it's really gross now. Okay, it's not that costing an awful lot of money. Let's try it one more time. Hopefully, this makes it better. Oh, I made it gross. Mine is a lot bigger now, though. Another boss kill. Let's do it. Later. Holy f I wasn't recording. Oh my god, I wasn't recording. Okay, so story time. You remember that trick shot thing that I kept doing? Yeah, that worked five times in a row. I came in third place. I managed to buy three legendary boss crates, opened them all, and they all won skin keys. Every single time doing that 360 jump off the thing bit. MLG Pro. Oh my god, I didn't record killing the boss. It wasn't as interesting, but I died twice. Oh my god, man, that sucked. I got five of them, but I sold four of them for GC. 269 times two. Five 540, and then I also sold one of them for 75,000 beacons to enter MF. So I can claim that. 75,000 beacons worth, and that's... How did I not record that? That sucks so bad. That was such good footage. Let's rank up next with my 76,000 beacons. I'm gonna upgrade stuff. You didn't see it because... I... That's so annoying. But I died twice to the exploding one. It keeps spawning the creeper and I keep losing. With my luck, I'm gonna buy these enchants and it's never gonna spawn the creeper ever again. Let's buy five. It's not too much money to fully get blast protection on all of this stuff. The other thing is protection. Protection. How much is five levels? <laughs> never mind. I'm gonna see if... All right, you know what? Screw it. I've only got seven billion. I can make seven billion in like, I don't know, seven minutes. I can make seven billion in like five minutes. Let's put five billion. Let's put, let's put five billion in. Someone will take me up on that. Oh, hello, Gerb. Ger um, please don't lose. Oof, and that's a lot. Uh -huh. I'm usually making between 1 and 1.5 billion per minute. So now that I've profited so much from killing boss mobs, in fact, I've made the money back to pay for the sword. I've made like a thousand coins. So my sword was free. Not bad. So it makes me wonder. I should probably start buying stuff like robots again, even though I sold some. So apparently there's a bit of a thing with this. A 4-4 netherite robot is about the sweet spot for usability. So I'm buying two of them, <laughs> which should actually start making me some money while I'm like not being able to mine. Every hour they generate 150 million coins. Not bad. Altogether they make 7 billion a day. Considering, you know, I've got them for free. Boss spawns in 13 beacons. Let's go. Boss spawns in 13 mob kills. I'm going. I'm coming. I'm coming, buddy. I'll help out. I'll help out. I'll get the kills. I'll get the kills. It's another exploding creeper. Are you kidding me? Surely now I can tank some of the damage. Oh, holy. I've got my timing down for this mob. Back to axe. Dude, this is proc twice already. And back to swords. Oh, okay. I'm not going to go near that for a minute. Now again, he's on less than half health. It's well worth it for me to take the few seconds I need to gapple and stuff because, oh my god, he's looking at me because otherwise I'll be sent back to, you know, spawn if I die. Oh, another dude, it's procced again. This might actually be it. If there's a time that I get first place, it's going to be this one and it's going to die in three, two, one. Second, second, damn it. I got a four epic boss crates though. Jesus. I got a ton of boss credits though. Let's open up my epic ones. Boom, 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 boom. Sort of meh, to be honest. Okay, now let me see. Let me see if this is rigged. One, two, three. So all I was doing was I was going, Boop. Oh, that sucks. Uh, it's, okay, never mind. It's not rigged. Five skin keys in a row. And... Ah! I just have to say the word skin key and then do it. Skin key! Skin key! Damn it! 
That sucks. Well, I got one skin kick. You know what? I've always wanted to use one of these. The only problem with this is it's pretty much a, um, you either win or lose. Everything that doesn't have an ability and I've lost. Well, I lost a skin kick. Doesn't really matter. I don't care. I have a bit of a mission to do. I gave myself 24 hours. I'm gonna take my 24 hours. I do this thing a lot where I want to get it done in the day. No, I'm using my 24 hours. I want to make the most insane pickaxe before I get to prestige. Yeah, I asked enchant what I should do if I should enchant my pick or just keep ranking up and the guy just said Finn, keep ranking up. Ah. I guess I just absolutely go hard on trying to rank up. Got a theory. Hold on. I just want to test. Listen, maybe I'm a little bit of a gambling man, but I have this spare skin that I'm not using called the tectonic drill and I want to make an item. I want to make a CF for it. I'm blue, so I guess I'll do diamond. Tectonic drill. All right, maybe someone will take it. I don't know how much the thing's worth. Not a ton. All right, I got some mining to do. All I'm going to do is grind and continually just level up e-tokens. Let's do it. Okay, fellas, things are looking a little different. I am at 1,700. I am still so stupidly far away from my goal of 2,000. I need 350 billion E-tokens. But I've been stacking up some and I've stopped ranking up because genuinely, it's felt like ranking up has been so much of a process. I think me getting a head start was actually kind of a bad thing for the late game because now I'm just trying to level up my pickaxe, man. I'm level 24. If I get to level 25, I unlock all these other enchants down there. The final tier of enchants. But as I've been mining, trying to level up my pick, I've noticed something else is that if I, I could technically, if I wanted to level up my jackhammer fully, it would only cost me only like, you know, 20 billion more. I can make 20 billion. The only problem is those jackhammer and uh, explosive charges when they go off, they do not net me as much of an XP boost as you think anymore. Look at this. I'm waiting for it. There we go. That did not make my XP bar jump nearly enough, so no good. I'm gonna hang around the center of the mine and just laser out all of this area, just so it's a little deep, and then I go down in here, and then I start mining. What I'm looking to happen is one of those explosives to fall out of the sky and grace my mine, like this. And then while it's in here, I wanna fly up, reset the mine, and now that's just encapsulated. And it does a way bigger explosion. So that's sort of my strategy on how to maximize stuff. My cell multi is completely maxed out, so I'm making the most I could possibly make out of all this stuff. And leveling up my mind genuinely doesn't seem to be making any faster because I'm not really getting too much of a difference out of something like this, Earth Splitter. I am maxed out. I stopped going up blocks on that. Same with Seismic Charge. I've stopped going up more and more because, again, look, it's fully absorbed by how big my mine is now if I'm mining in the middle. Leveling up my mine is good. It's it's just not really the way to make money right now. And I'm in late game sort of lag. I don't really know what to do about it. Oh, whoa! What was that? That is so rare. That was a 0.01% chance. Okay, dude, I've spoke to a lot of people in chat and I don't know if I should get this other enchant. It sounds a little dumb. But I think that it's probably one of those things that you should do at a higher prestigious after enchant costs isn't as much of a big deal. And right now I should be focusing on that prestige because while I do have a ton left to go, this is about half of what I need. Oh, I might take the risk and just start ranking up. How much is 10K of this? Everyone told me to buy it. Maybe this is a good option. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm ranking up first. No, I'm not. I want to get that. <laughs> Dude, it's like a new toy. I've got to max it out. Boom. And then let's rank up all. Rank 1,820. What's my mind going to look like? Oh, it's like it's snowing, like Christmassy. Oh, I'm on the last page. Holy sh- I need $236 billion. That is completely accomplishable. That's like two hours. I'm going to be out of prestige in like two hours. I have that much time. I got like five hours left on this thing. Okay, I swear to God, I have no- Clue what happened. I was just mining. A lightning happened. It was like yellow lightning just for a second. It would last. I couldn't have recorded that. What? But in chat, electric surge, you have received 25 million blocks. That could have happened many times and I would have never noticed it happen. So tier four enchants are really, really good. They're just really, really rare. But would that be faster for me to get all those enchants and then go for maxing it out? Or should, and then I'm just going to lose all of it in the prestige. I don't know which one's going to be faster. I may have to just go for it and, and go for the rank upgrades as fast as I can. Electric search just happened again. 27 million blocks. Is that filling up my inventory? Yeah, it is. It's not even containing it. 500 million. Yeah, whatever. 500 million. Dude, nothing. All right, let's see how much I get from electric surge now that I can actually hold the items. <laughs> there we go. 27 million blocks. I can hold all of that. That still made me about 1.1 billion. But here's the thing. I've been mining for about 10 minutes, maybe. I am making way, way more than a billion dollars a minute. Look at that. 700 million. Every other cell. Oh, there you go. Electric surge. Another 27 million. Another 1.1 billion. And then you come in. 
Another billion from that guy, all in the same minute. 500 million from a random enchant. Laser beams going at the same time. My quarry's going. Let's reset the mine. Laser finish. 5 million. Another 300 million from that. All within the last 30 seconds. Oh, a black hole opened up. No surprise to me. My pickaxe is so OP right now, man. It's not going to take me long at all. 3.9 billion dollars this minute. It is not going to take me very long to get to the top rank. Anyway, let's get to 1,100, boys. Let's go. All right, I did it. Okay, all right, let's go rank up. You know what? I'm just gonna do rank up all. There we go. 1,900. Let's see how the mine changes. <laughs> oh. Now this is what a top mine looks like, dude. I have to know what Seismic Charge does on this now. I'm just gonna mine right in the middle, roughly. There we go. Oof. Oh my god. A solid $800 million. All right, the other thing is I really have to use some of these robots and keys at some point because, good lord, I want to do this as fast as I possibly can. What if I get something that's going to help me level up? Not that. I don't care about that. Crystals? I still don't care. Beacons? Okay, I'll take 300 p. That's nothing. Boat key's no good. Booster pouch? Don't care. Oh my god. You want a crystal pouch? Take a crystal pouch. Shark keys actually might be solid. Give me something good. Beacons? You know what? I'll take it. 9k? 9k? 10k? Let's go. Okay, cool. That's pretty solid 10k beacons no not bad at all how's my drill doing at this point he's got some in it let's go let's claim that why not my total left is 141 billion and i've done that before so i could do that so let's speed run this thing let's do it I am so close to my goal of 2,000. I am less than 10 billion away. I am like two, one or two minutes away from ranking up, from finally being able to prestige. Supercharge, hello, buddy. It, that's gotta be it. Come on, that has gotta be it. I just need like one, oh, come on, one extra billion dollars. That's like barely anything, dude. I just need a couple Tesla stock options. Come on, bro. There we go. Please, this has gotta be enough. Let me check. I've supercharged it. It should be good. 1.41. Oh, dude, that's not gonna do it. I need one more. I'm gonna need one more. Yeah, hello. All right. As soon as that thing goes off, rank up all and sell and boom. Yes! <laughs> I did it! Finally! Oh my god, my Yes! <laughs> GG! Slowpoke, okay. This is without a doubt probably the best my pickaxe has ever been, thanks to the new enchants. I wish I could have got more stuff so I could upgrade the next one. But that might just be for the next map, and I want to get a head start as fast as I can, so I'm going to be on there as soon as it resets. Woo! Let me prestige. I just want to do it for the effect of it. I never get to do this. Enter prestige mode. I have to select all of this. My E tokens are going. Omni tools going. Backpacks going. Rank and mines going. Rules and robots going. Or the, the balance on it. Auto miner enchant are going and boom congratulations to finster for reaching prestige one and i'm back again <laughs> this is exactly what next map's gonna look like so uh see you then Peace!